I hear a lot of beginner agile coaches and scrum masters talking about how they suffer from lack of confidence and from imposter syndrome. Having been there myself and having coached literally hundreds of people in their successful agile leadership careers, let me share with you something that I learned. While imposter syndrome is a real phenomenon, what I see is that sometimes that feeling of being exposed as if you were a fraud sometimes is actually rooted in lack of competence. And that is a good thing. You know, when you don't have your ground in agile metrics, when you don't know how to coach, when you are not confident about facilitating big room planning, you just don't know it because you haven't done it or you haven't done it enough, or maybe you didn't even read that much about it. So here are five things to deal with it. Number one, assess your skills honestly. Identify the gaps and the deficiencies that are fueling those insecurities. Two, embrace growth, learn seek guidance, go and surround yourself with mentors. Three, invest in skill development, train, gain experience, and collaborate. Agile is about people and interactions. Four, reframe your doubts. If you address the competence thing heads on, you are then primed for growth and success. Five, it is natural to question, but let's move on. Let's strive for improvement.